Frankly, we need to transform our food system. If we can't fix our food system, we will not achieve the SDGs. If you look at the world's population, about a third are not getting enough of the right types of food, and another third are considered uh, obese or getting too much. Agriculture is a driver of many elements of environmental uh, degradation, whether it's water use, whether it's fertilizer use, whether it's the wrong use of pesticides, and of course, also climate emissions. The food system at large accounts for roughly a third of emissions. At the same time, the food system is one of the most vulnerable sectors or activities to climate change. So we've got to do something pretty urgently. As we have such challenging aspects and impacts of the food system, that's no counsel for despair because at the same time, there's these areas of transformation going on in many parts of the world that can help that benefit the food system and affect some of those statistics on climate change and other things. Agriculture can be a major driver of jobs. It can be a major driver of growth. The next revolution in agriculture and needed in food systems is going to require a huge infusion of knowledge and thinking and innovation and tools because it will not lend itself to off-the-shelf solutions that exist and can be applied in a neat standardized way. I'd say that the agriculture world has made huge strides in its shift in thinking, but we're probably only halfway. We would like CJR to be one of the driving forces for that shift in thinking to open up more demand for a shift in new policies and technologies. What you have in the CJR is the world's biggest agricultural research partnership for development. We have 15 research centers that specialize on a whole range of things that relate to this challenge. And that makes us quite unique. For this next shift, we need to think about complex systems and addressing complex interrelated challenges. And that's where you need new ideas, new knowledge, new technologies, new research on policy approaches, more convening of different stakeholders across very different groups. I think we're absolutely heading in the right direction. We're ready to help. We are strengthening ourselves right across the board and we want to play a central role in driving a shift of food systems so they're more sustainable, productive and benefit populations across the world.